Sup with it. To the stream. <laughs> Yo. Sup with it, D1. What's up, man? It is good to see you, my oh friend. Oh, my goodness. What I an introduction from Prague. Oh, my God. What Woo. a sweetheart. He is, man. Melee on, melee on me is on Prague. That's right. Woo. Man, so. Dude, so that last set. That was ridiculous. All right, I'm going to tell you one thing. So when I saw Animal versus Fiction, I really thought the Animal had it because game one and two were actually pretty close. Wow. But then that game three. Game three, he got blown up. He said, this guy's a fraud. What? Wow. Fiction said, you know what? I was a little bit nervous. These Coast crowds more than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> but now that I'm used to it, I'm going to expose this guy. He really did. I mean, four stocks. Exposed. <laughs> Expose. That was really rough stuff. And was that winners or losers? That's that's what me and Prague wanted to know. It's a good question. Uh, we don't have a bracket? Woo! Woo! I, I, <laughs> Woo! Woo! I don't know, man. Getting a little bit warm over here. <laughs> Getting a little warm. So, I, by the way, uh, yes. I just wanted to say it's like an honor to be here commentating on Team Spooky. Oh, my God. Absolutely. So happy that Team Spooky came out here to support Smash. So happy that Apex has grown into the, like the tournament that it is now. For everybody who doesn't know, Team Spooky is like one of the best FGC streams out there. So if you're not following, please follow this channel. And if you're not subscribing, you know oh, what to do. You know what to do. That's right. Get the purple button. Yeah, man. Get those skulls. Look at this production. Wow. Did you see Apex 2014 just slide over there? I like that white and red. Yeah, I really like that. that was... But wait a second. We've got Thorn and MACD. Oh, all right. So East Coast versus East West Coast. Coast. Versus... All right. So and Thorn is yeah. legit, right? Yes. Thorn is one of those those he's always a Falco player and I think that he's like underrated cuz people just don't know him. Yeah, he's, but been he's like the actually block. yeah, he's amazing. And Mac D is like I think Mac D thinks he's one of, he's the best peach <laughs> <laughs> uh, in <laughs> NA. I, I don't know who would be though. I guess Peach is one of those characters where it's like there's Armada and everybody else. Yeah. I mean, you have the OH, you have Mac D. Um does Pix and OB even play anymore? No. No. Uh. RIP. R.I.P. Pichinobi. We miss you. Not in real life, but you know, R.I.P. in the yeah, city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just in case. Oh, wow! Shield poke! Watch your head, Falco. Good stuff, and Thorn is just having a tough time getting his footing here. Dude, so what do you think about this stage? I think that MACD must have done some magic when striking. Yeah, like seriously, I, is I don't know, man. I mean, I like Falco on this stage oh. against Peach, though. But Thorn takes stock one after everything we just say. Yeah. The back air at like, what, 90? It's that West Coast DI. The way out West. <laughs> it's the West, the West Coast DI. I didn't wanna, oh! I didn't want to fire shots, but you did. Sometimes you have to, dude. You got to respect it. <laughs> All right, there we go. And it's still a tightish battle. Three stocks apiece. Tied up. Now, oh my God! The reverse board air. If you were a Falco in this matchup, what would you do? One what thing would I, I do. I do notice that Thorn does opt for a lot of platforms against Peach, especially the top one. Platform camping is, you know, no spaces are stranger to that against floaties for sure like peach. so what what peach wants falco to do i think is approach straight on yeah and thorn is like doing a really good job of not doing that you always woo, you don't even want to come from below peach because she can spin around her down smash is like amazing yes so i think what thorn's doing right now is he's playing really cautiously if he's right in front of her and otherwise just trying to come down with falco's amazing aerials oh yeah. <gasps> he goes for the short wow. and it misses wow mac, and mac D. D closes that stock out and this is the rough thing about this matchup, man. If Falco takes too much damage, even if he's at mid percent, it sets Peach up for a really good edge guard opportunity. Yeah. Even actually at zero, because Falco, he technically spawns at death percent. Ooh. Ooh. Wow, that was just a rogue forward smash. That was rogue. Wow. wow. He just went in. He was like, you know what? I think you just might get hit by this man. Take it. <laughs> Take it. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Eggum had the old joke, Falco spawns death percent. I think it's really funny and really kind of true. <laughs> Falco gets hit and it's just and like, uh-oh. Look at him. He's like... If he uh, got hit with that forward air, that was... Oh, oh my god! Amazing forward Beautiful smashes right forward now. smash. Wow, two of them. Looking like the Shizwiz. You Man. remember Shiz's forward smashes? Yeah, he got... He was so consistent with them, too. And back then, I really thought they were random, but you know what? They were calculated. Yo. Yo, these combos on Peach right now. MACD at 61%. Oh, oh my gosh! He's on the stage! Dumpster! Dumpster. The garbage man is in the building, and his name is Thorn. We are here, Apex and Twitch united. Oh, what's up? What's up, man? Dude, uh, so Mac D right now is lifting the the hood of the dumpster up, crawling his way out. <laughs> He's like, yeah, man, I'm, game two. I'm back, dude. Definitely has like that some was... maggots on his shoulder, brushing them <laughs> off. <laughs> that was a really convincing game. I think that yeah. the stage was definitely in Peach's favor, and I think Thorn just straight up outplayed him. Straight um, up, he was. He was like probably more patient, I think, than uh, than Mac D was expecting. Cause like I feel like Peach should not get 
overrun like that. Yeah. Oh, but we got FD. Everybody knows FD, the chain grabs. Yeah, I really like this decision by Magdi. No platforms. Thorne has to fight him straight up or just run away and, act, you know, get some real estate. Oh. I don't think Thorne is uh, too afraid of just running away, though. Yeah. Good stuff. Nice little combo, 53%. Oh, wow. my God. I really like that decision. Instead of going for, like, a shine back air out of shield, that was really solid. Wow, look at those wavelands. Looking like PC Chris from back in the day. Yes. Oh, here we go. Hey. Oh, the crowd. Oh, we'll let hey. the crowd do it for us. Nice by Magdi. He knows his percents. He does. Beautiful. Oh, my God. Nice stuff. All right, we see you, Mac D. Nice. We see you. Good, oh, good stuff. These turn of combos. Yeah, that was a really nice wave dash back. You saw he went for that grab, and that would have been this would have been sick, but it didn't happen for him. Oh, oh, solid by Mac D. Oh, nice. floating. Is he gonna? Okay, he makes it. Yeah. Oh, but Tomahawk though, empty jump grab. Good roll by Thorn. Oh, but he's getting just pushed into the corner. Will he make it back? Oh, it trades! And that was actually a pretty good trade because Magdi is still up a stock, and he took a, a stock off of Thorn. I like this. Yeah. Given the situation, I'm sure he, he just wanted to get that clean forward air. Forward air. Oh! Oh, here we go! This Tech is not uh, looking like Thorn's game right now. No, not at all. I feel like you need to be playing really, really well on this stage to win. Yeah, because Peach's just, punishes are just too strong. Yeah, here. the fact that Magdi's getting the hits that he's getting, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, Thorn's got to mix it up, make that adjustment, stop getting hit. Don't get hit, just like Isaiah says. Yeah, that, see, that, that grab is just, yeah, it's going to be a stock. And that was really smart Ooh. by Magdi. He ended that chain grab really early, and that probably threw off his Oh, oh my gosh, he just smashes him in the fifth for taunting. That was shooting shots with that taunt. Definitely. Mad disrespect. Oh. He's not going to let him touch him. Will he? Nope. Nope. He's back on stage. Nice power oh. shield, and Magdi is back in there. Magdi with three stocks. Is he going to roll? Okay, he just grabs him. Oh. Hey. Oh, looking like Armada. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely looking like Armada right now. Ooh. Look at that looked like a read of What that full jump forward air? Yeah, right? Yeah, for yeah. sure. Definitely trying to look, look, look real preemptive. I think that's like the noob slayer. Yeah. Noobs when they're in the corner, they love jumping up because roll feels dangerous. Like everything but jump straight up feels dangerous. But when you get to higher levels, people don't do it as much. Yeah. Higher levels, did you? Look at Falco, he's got a parachute. The parachute didn't come parachute. out! Rob64! <laughs> <laughs> I need support. Oh my goodness. And he's, oh, he didn't change his uniform? Okay. All right, all right. Cool blue Falco. That's a, a favorite of Falco mains, I think. Yeah. L let me see. Which Falco mains back in the day used to rock that? Uh, PC? Cool blue? Cool blue? Uh, I don't remember what PC was. I know... Dude, I don't remember. I'm huh? embarrassing myself. I think this is the PC color, though. Yeah, let, let, let's just make believe it was. Anyway, next to the, uh, back to the match. Wait, I want to talk about these Falco colors more. All right. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but for, red was New Jersey Falco. That's all yeah, I'm going to say. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Oh. And good backers. We need more of those by Thornton. How's he going to make it? Good stuff by this opting to go high. Yeah. yeah. But not the right forward beat. Yeah. But he was in a tough spot there anyway. If he upbeat, Peach has so many options. Oh, up big combo set up. I oh. like that he spiked him into the stage. Good, you know, and Magdi waited. It was very smart. Yeah. Oh, punish. Okay, good stuff. That was a good attempt by Magdi. Oh, Ooh. wow. Magdi forgets that he doesn't have a float and just, <laughs> just slaps the air on yep. his way down to uh, the abyss. And look at that. His power shields. He just had two straight back-to-back -back power shields. Really good. And another one. That's a West Coast stuff, dude. We're not messing around. Goes for the back air to down smash. Thorn wisely DI's away. Oh, starting this combo. I like nice this. Nice laser off yeah. the top platform. And now. Ooh, four. Ooh. Uh oh. Boom. Oh. Oh, Mac D. Okay. Almost Armada. Almost. Not quite. Not quite, though. Yeah. Not yet. Give him another year. Yeah, uh, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> We're just playing. We love you, Mac D. Good stuff. Nice laser grab. Something that everybody can learn. Laser grab, just laser forces you in shield and then grab. What's up? And one thing that Thorn could do, just in case a person, you know, power shields those lasers as much as Mac D does, if he shoots a low one. No! What happened? That what, what edge cancel! Yes. A that lot of Falcos have been doing that a lot in the pools today. And Mac D did not respect Thorn. He was like, no, you're not about to edge cancel this. <laughs> and Thorn was like, yo. What's up? And he got I got it. that edge cancel. <laughs> Also, oh. Thorn, Thorn not trusting himself. I think that up B, if he went for the ledge, like he could have been safe, but it was a tough angle, so he opted for the safer angle and Calm. died. Oh. Oh. Calm oh. down. Trying to hit him with the Firebird. I don't think that would work at that percent. Yeah, just a little too high. 
Ooh. But the crowd loved it. Yeah. Oh, MACD making it back. Nice. Uh, oh. You, you know, one thing I really liked from uh, Thornton over there, those light shields. A lot of players yeah. should opt for those too. If pushes, that's how, it, oh. That's how you know somebody's like starting to optimize their game when they do stuff that other people, like lots of other players don't do. Like light shields is just something that not too many people have explored. You always hear people talking about I know. Every moment's nerve-wracking because of Falco. <laughs> he's just so fragile. Oh, and he's living. Living? Wait. Do I smell a back air? What? Ooh. That was kind of? That was a matrix that Yo! Waveland grab. Ooh. Whip Peach, though. Oh, okay, Ooh. okay. Don't know who he thought he was there with that turnaround grab. I, I, I'm going to call that the future. Future, that, 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 <laughs> future sight. That's like the 2016 grab that might work. Oh, oh nice. my god. Hey. And the taunt. That Invincible, a, by the way, if you don't know. That was a read on that up smash for sure. Oh. Oh, oh no. He needs to be careful. Oh, no. Hey. The whole game is turned around. This was so even, and now Peach has all the momentum. Thorn off stage, looking and like the dream. Oh, he sets him home. The dream's over. Wow. You hear like three people cheering West Coast. And the West Coast chants so good. Get real. West Coast.